And it is going to be Jackson Bird to bowl the first ball of the match. And it's wide of the off stump of Henry Hunt. Engaging stuff here. Three slips of gully and a short leg. And he's beaten again. And this time he's gone. Siddle has the wicket. Uh, the South Australian skipper has to go. So far, Siddle to Drew on the back foot. Good shot. Very good shot uh, to the short boundary. We're out to the west today. That's the first boundary of the day, and it's a good one. To the lefties. There's Sunshine as Weatherall slaps that behind points for four. What a good shot. He's got fast hands. Charges in again, the veteran. Short pitch delivery cut away. And out. Like, we don't call it the Apple Isle here anymore, do we? We'll talk about that more in a moment. It's this driving weather already splits the gap. That'll be a nice confidence booster. Any time you can lean forward and hit the middle through the covers, it's for sure Meredith again. Driving through the covers. What a shot. With these medium paces. Off the back foot, into the offside. That's a good shot. Right up on his toes. Last ball of the over, driven down the ground from Weatherald, and that is the shot of the day. Three slips. Meredith drifting onto leg stump, and that's tucked away very nicely by McSweeney for four more. The runs, when, they, uh, when they're there, they're taken. So far, it's got them to the second spot on the ladder. Oh, that's a good shot by McSweeney. Punching that one through mid-on, and that ought to go to the rope. It will, or will it not? Yes! The race has been won. Only 18 overs old. And he's hit that one very well through the offside. Four runs. Yep, good shot. A little bit short there from Webster. Backward square and at fine leg. Full delivery spanked through the offside. Another boundary here to Weatherald. Yes, ever since that half chance went down. Webster now driving again. That's a good-looking cover drive. That's his seventh boundary. He's got 32 runs. Back third of the pitch. Quite amazing. Oh, slashing! That was a wind-up from Weatherald. Driven down the grounds. Good timing, that as well. So the red back backs the story here as we get closer to lunch. 27 and a bit past the hour local time that's runs that's what that is a half volley on the pads a long boundary out there but it'll get there to Meredith that's a good shot a bouncer hooked in front of square again but he's there and there's more runs for Weatherall he has batted so well today off the front foot through extra cover that'll be another boundary an upright approach Another good shot through mid-on, through the onside by having sweaty full face of the bat. And that's going to run up the hill. It's a long way up there, but it's four. Oh, he goes for that Weatherald over mid-on. It wasn't a convincing shot, but effective. Down to the southern end of the state to make his... This time he goes down the ground. Whack! Here's Meredith again now from the northern end, clipped away for a boundary. Good shot. Name in these parts of the, this part of the world. And look at uh, Weatherall there, opens the shoulders and lobs it into the potting stand. There's a six. There's a good shot by Weatherall. What a fine off drive. That's four. Caught, out. First slip. Weatherall doesn't get through that. Tricky patch, and he's gone. Oh, catch and out! He's got him, Siddle. He probed away again. Lehman. Full delivery driven down the ground with some nice timing. McSweeney, I don't know whether it'll get there. I think it'll crawl. Jared Freeman's not quick. Driving down the ground. More runs here. That's timed pretty well. Racing away. Again, this might just pitch just before. Bird to Kelly. That's beaten him every league. He's out. Caught behind. Oh, that's a breakthrough for Tasmania. I thought it had gone between Kelly's bat and pad. It may well have done, but it also might have taken some bat. Nielsen off the edge. Caught. Well caught by Webster. Hasn't he got a good set of hands? There's the Meredith uh, factor again. 
Lovely drive from Ben Mignetti on the front foot. What about that? Four runs. Where's the round of applause? That was a beautiful shot. Full toss, and that's put away by McSweeney. He's really good through that area. That's a boundary for him. Do all the action. And there's Mignetti swinging into the onside. Very well timed for four. This is quite a knock. This time on the pool, into the gap. Four runs. What a shot. He's now Bo Webster. Oh, and the beauty and the catch is taken by Tim Payne. And Menenti departs. Webster gets one to deviate. Uses his feet again and forces Whiteman on. This will be the 100. What an excellent innings. Jordan Silk will give up the chase. 101 not out for Nathan McSweeney. His first shield century. An innings of great application. And there's McAndrew into the offside again for more runs out to the western boundary. This is good, good material for the Redbacks. Very good. He's in here to Nathan McAndrew. That's a very good shot through the offside of the front foot. Four runs. This is a bit of a problem for the Tigers. Settle over the wicket. Good shot from Nathan McSweeney. He's been doing that all day off the front foot. Plenty of left elbow. Good timing. It won't go to the boundary. All full delivery team on the pads right in front. It looked pretty close. And the umpire had no hesitation. And this fabulous innings of McSweeney ends. LBW. A yard slower from most of his career. He's still, he's still there, isn't he? Thereabouts. Absolutely.